This art project is inspired by American artist and educator Lois Mailu Jones. Jones painted works in a variety of styles, including Impressionist and Abstract. Before her career in the fine arts, she had been working as a textile designer and fashion illustrator. She later became a professor at Howard University, where she taught painting and design. Jones looked towards Africa and the Caribbean and her experiences in life when painting. Scrolling through her paintings, you can see how she incorporates textile designs with her African themes. Her work is especially known for strong color and design. In this project, we are recreating her African masks painting. And here are the things that we need. Starting with the full sheet of white paper, you want to create the background. In Lois Milo Jones' paintings, you have a background that is of different colored blocks. For mine, I'm using blue, orange, yellow, red, and brown blocks. Some of my blocks I won't color in and I'll leave it white. You can use any set of colors that you want. I'm also using crayons, but you can use any medium that you have available. Your background will look totally different than mine since you might use different size blocks and different colors. The next part will be drawing in your African mask. Taking a full sheet, I fold it in half so I can tear or cut it in two. And taking one of the halves, you want to cut that in half, so now you have a quarter piece. The quarter piece will be for a smaller mask, and then the half sheet will be for the bigger one. Looking at some of these examples, I'm going to create my two masks. Mix and match some of these features and create your own unique African masks. You have enough paper with a full sheet for three masks. You can do two small ones and one bigger one. I'm drawing my mask with pencil first and then giving it a nice outline with a black marker. Afterwards, give it some nice color. Then cut it out and glue it onto your background. And that's it! I hope you had fun doing this project. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!